We're here at Don't Ever Bank here field in Cracks and Skull, Florida. Come here for the retirement. Stay here for the drive through funeral services. Getting buried has never been so quick and easy. I wouldn't mind taking a dirt nap here. Although my dream for years has been to be soaked in rum, then thrown into a volcano. <laughs> I like the idea of going out with a bang. And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Cleveland Burns take on the Cracks and Skull Jugulars. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Oh, uh -huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toaster oven. That'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. That pass play was good for three yards. Second down and seven. Ouch! What is this, Eddie's wrestling? And it's first and ten. Runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And that is caught for a first down. First down and seven. Hot. Hot one, hot two. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. <laughs> comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Now here comes the punting unit. 
You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I pictured that, uh, that well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Pump returners, and man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And that'll be second down and four. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. <laughs> Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten oh and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out Keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. Third and four. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond.
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Hot three. Like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Third down and, well, good luck. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Target more often. And it's first and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Bray grabbing a ball and didn't fall down. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. <laughs> nice run for five yards. Second down and five. First and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, with the brutal hit! First down and six. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake.
looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot now it looks like the coach is ripping that play from the playbook. What a dud. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Graham. First and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And the quarterback goes into a... They stunt the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost poetic, Grim! Like a haiku! And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Keep a good mutant down. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Oh, with the punishing hit. And that'll be take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if it is, but he sure has a good set of hands. <laughs> And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn.
second down and two. Well, as a quarterback, you have to take risks. And his cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 30. He's at the 20. He could go over. And yeah, never mind. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Hot, hot, hot. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick and it keeps on ticking. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. And it's first and ten. in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. hot. Quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second down and five. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. 
straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. First and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second and three. He picks up a two. And that'll bring up third and one. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And he gets three yards on that run. <laughs> Second down and seven. Hot, hot one. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Second down of seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot two. And he's rolling. That one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot two. And he just wrestles him. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. First and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a conference at home. Second down and five. I just may be in commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right, you should. Third down and five. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. <laughs> the 
Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> the offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? tackles and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down this guy has a nice set of hands Win. it's the third set of hands he's had so long today looks like it's a good fit he grabs it and picks up four on that reception second down and six Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big porn at Johnny. And the defense anticipated a pass there and put an end to their offensive drive. Like my wife always said, not tonight. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. Come at it, anything really tastes good. Third down and long. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Two, hot, hot. Great play! He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Rex. Very smart. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Up nine yards on that catch. Only two minutes left in the game. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. Third down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And the D takes their second time out, hoping for a miracle. I witnessed a miracle once. A player was brought back from the dead. That's not a miracle, partner. That's just how the MFL works. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And a hurry up.
up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's for that's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Wow, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's coupon night at Taco Hell. He has better footwork, though, than me. On account of not clenching his cheeks. They want more points, so they're going for two. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. I think you ought to be able to shoot a guy in the end zone doing a dance like that. For extra points, you know? Plus, it would speed the game up. Hey, good point. Just get some better dogs tired. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. <laughs> They'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. You know, before the last play, Bricks, I didn't even know you could have penalties on kicks. And now this shit? And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. He's not going down. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he breaks away. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. The Jugular cracks some skulls today. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it Scrabble's tomato soup? I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Damn, I know. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...